Have you ever been afraid? Has there been times in your life when you've been caught up in fear? We really don't like that term, but truth be told, all of us have those moments. Even King David said, at times I am afraid, I will trust in the Lord. And so all of those events of life, circumstances, sometimes cause us fear. Now, we don't like that term, and so sometimes we'll use the word anxious. Have you ever been anxious? Well, I want to give you a wonderful verse. It's one of my go-to verses. When I find myself afraid or caught up in fear, or I won't call it that, I may say when I'm anxious, I find myself going to a verse in Philippians chapter 4. And when Paul writes this, he's actually quoting Jesus, what he said on the Sermon on the Mount. Philippians 4, verse 6, listen to this verse. Be anxious, fearful, for nothing, but in everything, through prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. When you are, not if you're afraid, but when you're afraid. You know, the word anxious means to be pulled in different directions. Now, when the writer uses this, he's not so much talking about an issue or a circumstance or a situation. Today, we're caught up in the coronavirus, and we'd say, well, that's causing me fear. But when the writer says, be anxious for nothing, he's not talking about a particular circumstance. He's talking about how we respond to a circumstance. And so he says to us, our response is very important or we'll be pulled in different directions. And by the way, that word anxious, the old English word for that means to strangle. And so we find ourselves sometimes being strangled by the circumstances of life. Well, what do we do then? What's the anxiety pill? Well, notice what the writer says. Be anxious for nothing, but in everything through prayer. And then he kind of defines prayer for us. Supplication. That's, that's just unburdening your heart to God. With thanksgiving. That talks about the character of God, that we can trust God. Let your requests be made known to God. Charles Spurgeon one time said that asking is the rule of the kingdom. And I like that because that means that we can go to our Heavenly Father through Jesus Christ and we can ask Him anything. Ask Him for everything, but He only gives what He deems appropriate. He always gives us a calmness in our anxious heart. And in those moments in my life, pastoring over these 35 years, there's a lot of times I find myself caught up in anxiety. Something will happen, this will happen. Right now, is it could easily be a cause of anxiety. And so what I do is I find myself running to, to Philippians 4, verse 6. Tom, be anxious for nothing. But Tom, in everything through prayer, and supplication with thanksgiving let your request be made known to God the next verse says and the peace of God which passes all understanding will guard your hearts and minds in Christ Jesus God bless you